What are the main differences between playing in Sweden and playing in Italy? I think Sweden scene isn't really as functional as the Italian one is right now. Like Italian has kind of figured their things out. They just need to start finding new ways to make it become bigger. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much the main one. What do you think of Italian teams? I think Italian teams are pretty good. Uh, they're, I think they're very underrated, apart from like the other teams in like Germany, France. But uh, I think like Italian teams have a shot at making it. But the other teams just look so much stronger in terms of Italy. That's like the main point. And what do you think of the Italian sports scene in general and of the League of Legends scene in particular? I don't know that much about the rest of the esports scene in Italy. I've heard like from most of it, like the CSGO one, that it was like pretty bad and it wasn't like any subst substantial way to keep it floating. But the League of Legends one seems to be doing fairly okay. You decided to be a local player. Why? Uh, I mainly did it to manage to get a solid lineup with a team that we can actually qualify to a Masters for and actually have a good showing there, which isn't something Italy has been known for in the past. And which team would you like to face in this split? I mean, person, personal-wise, I would like to split, play against Raccoon, since they're my last team. Uh, so I kind of want to like win against uh, yeah, my old team. But uh, competition-wise, I want to play against OP, since they seem to be the strongest and most hyped team. Thank you very much and good luck. Thank you.